blow you away. Uh, it's uh, called the Amitha Verma Transform 7-Piece Paint Kit. So what this is going to allow you to do is take any piece of furniture, something you might even be thinking about throwing away. Maybe you saw a nice piece of furniture in a tag sale or flea market, and you're like, hmm, I think I could turn that into a magical piece. Well, with Amitha's kit, you can. It shows you everything you need in simple steps, how to take ordinary furniture and transform it into something extraordinary. Transform the old, the furniture, the cabinets, the chairs, any beautiful piece. You can update your decor in 60 minutes or less. What I love is that she makes it easy to do. Hey, listen, there's a lot of professional faux painters out there that'll charge you $1,200 to decorate a chair. But who's got that kind of money and who's got that kind of time? You can do it yourself for less than $100. Everything you need, including the paint. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back at home. Cooking is my life. Mm. Cooking at home for my family is a special time. So I want everybody out there to have a great time in the kitchen while they're cooking. And the most important thing is to have the right appliances and the right pots and pans. I give it to all my chefs in the restaurant and they give me suggestions and they try them out. And so can you at home. and welcome back in everybody. We're really, really excited. If any of you has tried Amitha Verma's kit, we'd love to take your testimonials. We'd love to hear from you because this is truly an amazing way to take ordinary furniture and to make it in something uh, extraordinary. Before you throw away those old pieces or maybe you've, you, you know, you went to your aunt's house and they're giving away some old chairs or a table or, you know, or an end table, coffee table. Before you do that, let Amitha show you how you can breathe new life in that and make it look gorgeous. We're talking about great ways to be able to finish and fill paint, and everything is all in one step. Everything you need to transform is in one easy step. Amitha Verma, designer, a person who specializes in taking yes. things from the past <laughs> and making them look great, and whether we're antiquing them or we're bringing them into Some more fresh of a life. fresh look. Yes. I've never worked with you before. I'm yes, really excited. Yes, it's so great to meet you guys. You. Thank you yep. so much for having me here. I'm so excited to be here, yeah. and I'm so excited to be doing a live furniture makeover transformation. This is going to be, be fun. so exciting. I know. Yes, 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 yes. I'm putting I, my cards away because I want to make okay, my hands free. Okay, get your hands a little bit yeah, dirty. Yeah, you yeah. won't get them too dirty. <laughs> now, I know so many of us are frustrated with out-of-date colors, mismatched sure. furniture, old kitchen cabinets from the 60s, 70s. So I'm going to show you how to use our kit and do this live makeover so you can do these amazing designer transformations all on your own. Everything you need is in the kit. It's in the kit. So Everything I don't have to go buy paint. I don't no. need glaze. I don't need the finishing stuff. I, everything's here. Everything's Brushes, in there. Everything. Yes. Okay. So let's get started with the first step. The first step is going to be to paint your project. Now, what makes our paint so unique is you can paint with no sanding, stripping, or priming. Okay. So Say that one more time. <laughs> no sanding, stripping, or priming. Right. So we've taken six to eight weeks off of your off project. Off of the kit. Okay. So right. no need to wait for hubby to help you. All right. You're going to take your paintbrush. This is included in the kit. Beautiful mm -hmm. natural bristle. Dip it in. Before you get started, I want you to give your paint a good stir. Make sure it's really, really well Really good stir. You can see the consistency here. Yeah. It's like yogurt. And I'm going to show you what that's going to do for you. Okay. And then we're going to come over here. This is like an old dark piece of furniture. I want you to imagine that piece of furniture yeah. that you have that drives you crazy. Yeah. Yeah. And imagine this transformation. So you're going to get a coating at, on here. Look at how, how it covers. Look at how it covers. That's what that thickness does for you, as well as adheres to more than just wood. You can paint over wood, concrete, so many different surfaces. So we're just going to keep doing this. And you can see I'm hardly using any paint at all. Okay, and just getting it paint. all in the little cracks and yes. all the little crevices. And this is exactly <clears> what you're <throat> going to do. Okay. Now, we're going to do this all over the chair and then we're going to let it dry for 20 minutes. Okay. I'm not going to let you wait for 20 minutes. No, no, no. We don't have the time. Do you so, want to right, see we'll, the after? Yeah, let's Are you ready to see the after? Forward. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Let's walk over here and now you're going to see the after. So imagine that dark piece of furniture and now here is the after. Okay. It is breathtaking. This mm. is what it's going to look like your project once you get home and start working on it. It's going to have this gorgeous matte finish and it's going to be Stunning. Yeah. Oh, I love how it feels. Do you love yeah, how it feels? Very like beautiful. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to move on to step two, which is included in your kit. In step two, we are going to seal our newly painted finish. This is what the sealer looks like. It feels like um, shortening. 
Do we okay. have any Southerners yeah. watching? You know yeah. what short Almost is. like a Vaseline type exactly. of... Exactly. Okay. Even more solid than that. All right. So we're going to use the brush that's included in the kit, dip it in, get your sealer on, and mm -hmm. then you're just going to apply it's a like light a shoe coat. polish. Is exactly. Kind of, yeah. Exactly. Okay. And you're so just going to apply this on. What is this doing right now? Oh, block? good question. Okay, yeah. so we want to apply the sealer to protect against soiling and staining. Okay. This is what's going to give you that long-lasting, time-lasting finish. Okay. I've got two little boys, my hubby, my pets, my kids. So we want to make sure this is going to last us a test of time. So this this size piece of furniture should take about two minutes for you to get that coverage to on you there. To cover it, okay. Super easy. All right. We're going to let that dry mm -hmm. for 20 minutes. And then we're gonna move on to the third step, which is completely optional, but everybody's favorite. Yeah. Okay, let me show that to you. So we're gonna walk over here. And by the way, everything that you're seeing is included in the kit that, that, that comes yes, today. Yes, so. everything mm -hmm. that you're seeing is included in the kit. Now this is everyone's favorite part. I had to include it, but it's totally optional. If you wanna take your project one step further, you can use our antiquing glaze to add this character. I've already done a little bit so you can see it. Add this mm. depth into the piece. Now you're gonna take the same brush. There's one brush for step two and step three. Okay. Dip it into your antiquing glaze. You're gonna get a thin coat on, and then you're just gonna use like a light feathering motion. Okay. I'm not- Just to kind of grab just, little highlights and yes. places. See okay. how it went on right yep. there? And you're just gonna use your brush to blend. See how the brush just does mm -hmm. all of the work for you? So it does all the heavy lifting. It gives it so much more dimension, and it, you know what? And it gives it that antiqued look. It absolutely does. That beautiful, luxurious, yeah. high-end designer style. Look at this little medallion right here and how it just totally comes to life. Comes to life. In the before yep. chair, it looks so old-fashioned and outdated, and right. now it's the signature piece of the chair. Oh, it's gorgeous. Right, and then yes. you can decide, you know, if you want to uh, do the different fabric on your chair, you yes. can do that as well. You get everything. We're going to show you some really cool before and afters here that are, that are quite amazing. Why don't you take us through some of these? I mean, sure, let me neat. show you some of these. They're yeah. awesome. So you can see the before of this old cane back chair. A lot of us have cane pieces. It's very popular from the 50s and 60s. And look how modern and fresh and light and bright you can make it. The color you're seeing on that chair is Provence blue. What you're seeing on the little side table, the before, and then the after is in Chantilly White. Chantilly White. Let's talk about the colors a little That's, bit. I was going to say, do we, have our, do we have our little color thing we can throw out there, Erin? Let's do that because obviously you get to choose a color of what you want to do. We're not yes. just going to do everything in white. So, right. so what are our colors? Here they are. This, what you're seeing on this chair right here, Chantilly White in that bottom corner, that's our number one selling color. We're probably gonna sell out and we're gonna have a decorating emergency. <laughs> it's everybody's favorite. Belgian blue, it's a white with a hint of blue. Very sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Latte beige, classic combination of gray and beige. So very sophisticated, both masculine, both feminine. Provence blue, that classic French countryside blue. Don't be afraid to paint a piece of furniture or your kitchen island, just like you saw that chair that mm -hmm. I did. It's a great color. And then French gray, that's our probably our number two selling color. It's that classic French gray. Is it right. blue? Yeah. Is it green? Right. Is it gray? All Kinda of the above. The I love that color. Absolutely. It's a great color. So mm -hmm. you can't go wrong with any of them. Any of them will really go beautifully with the colors in your house. Let me remind everybody, I only have 800 of these all together in all the colors. So if you're looking around your house right now and you're seeing that chair, you're seeing that little bench, you're seeing that piece of furniture and yes. you're going, I was going to throw that yes. away. Before, Don't throw it away. Before you strip it, and sand it, and uh, which is, I think that's that's really 90% of the reason people don't do that's it. That's why no one does it, because it yeah. used to be so difficult, and now it's just fun. Let me show you another yeah. demo, so Let's I can show you over. how easy it is you. to use. Okay. Now think about your dining room. Now I want you to know one quarter paint's gonna cover three, all the pieces in the kit are gonna cover three to four pieces of furniture. Okay. So think about that dark dining room set. So many of us have that dark dining room set, Imagine that as I do this transformation. I think people are also used to having to buy so much paint because it's so thin and it doesn't cover. Exactly. This is specifically made to cover on one shot. What Anitha did was she said, why do people not do this? Why do they often hire a decorative artist to do that? that because a decorative artist how much, doesn't... how much does that cost? Hey, listen, I, I told <laughs> you I was in the business for many years of doing that and faux painting and glazing. It's expensive and it's time consuming. At least a several hundred dollars a and, piece. And a wall could take you all day. All day. This know? is going to work out to about twenty-five dollars per piece yeah. to work on. And you're going to and you're going to get four. that furniture, and you could probably turn around and sell that for ten times yeah, what you thought you were going to. Yeah, that's a different secret. <laughs> exactly. Yes, we know that. A lot of you are going right now. Maybe I should start going to the flea market. Maybe we do I have start... a lot of people who get into the business <laughs> of in finding old furniture. Do look how quickly I have done this chair. 
Yeah. You could literally do this project in probably an hour. Do you know, for a while there, I, I, I started a little small thing that I used to do where I would go to, a bar, you know, old flea markets. I'd go to closeout places yes. and stuff like that. And I would buy window frames and I would turn them into mirrors. Absolutely. And I would, and I would just, uh, make I would do over. this. Yes. I'd make them look old, but nice. But I bet it would take forever before. It, it took, it, you know, I had to sand and do all that stuff because yes. I didn't have this. This is But you could still buy something for 10 bucks and sell it for 150 oh, yeah. bucks. The value is incredible. Yeah. You can take this old set of chairs now and, and the beauty of, in them is amazing. It's going to be worth the oh, price at, of the new Look market. at some of these pieces, how you yes, transform them. Yes, that was an old it. vintage look piece. That. And yeah. look at the stunning French country. country. That's Provence blue. So right? you can see how beautiful it's going to look. Now we're going to look at French gray. This is what French gray looks wow. like. It's very classic, very beautiful. And, and it just keeps going on and on and on. And don't yes. be afraid. I think a lot of people out there are worried that they're not going to do it right. But you include no. you include yes. a DVD, right? Yes. It can, we're doing this fast. I know. So you're going to be able to watch a DVD. I'm very verbose. I've written a little booklet for you. So mm -hmm. you can read the booklet and step by step follow along. Let me show you how to do the clear sealer and then I'm gonna show you the antiquing okay. glaze because that's where people get really nervous. Now that you've seen the painting, you can see. Here, you want me to do Why it so you, you can show me? Yes. I mean, come okay, on. Okay, so dip so it in. Uh, now remember, get a light you know coat. how when you do, you do do car, uh, uh, shoe polish and you just kind of do the little tips, it's kind of the same thing. And then okay, I just light kinda... coat. You can see he's not smashing it in, or maybe you can't see, but he's not smashing it in. He's using the lightest touch, almost like a feathering motion. It goes on but really easily, too. It goes too. on so, and look at the applicator tool. It really does the work this for you. This brush is killer. It's killer, I love it. <laughs> we designed right. it to put that product on because it used to be so hard with the rag and the soft cotton cloth. What are you supposed to use? It makes this big mess, and I want it easy, well, that's, effortless, and fun. Well, when, fun, I used, fun, fun. when I used to glaze, okay, yes. you'd, have, you'd have an old coffee can bucket. Yes. You'd have to put glaze and water in. Right. Extremely fumy yes. and toxic and yes. nasty anyway. Yes. And then you have to actually put your hand in there with gloves and then you have to try to... And how was the finish? It was uneven all the time. On, yes. Always uneven yes. and you had to work it over Absolutely. and over. And that's why there are decorative artists that do that job because right. they know that. Right. People like me, I mean, come on, we just no. want we just want to get the end look. I designed this kit for people who have not picked up a paintbrush since grade school. Mm -hmm. You cannot mess it up. It's foolproof, it's effortless. We'll walk you through it in the DVD. We'll walk you through it in the chest of drawers. Oh, that's what's on the DVD. As a spoiler see, and, alert, and I know, gave it away. <laughs> and, and let me tell you something else. It's a lot of fun because you watch pieces of art come to life. Come to life. And you and yes. you did it. That's yes. the thing. So if you're looking for a project, all right, drop the crossword puzzle and come on in and try yes. and make yourself a beautiful piece of furniture. The pride that you feel, and you don't have to put a lot on. You see how I saw I had some on there? Just kind of give it that brush. Very little bit. Now, if you want more, you can put more. It's your home, and I want you to do what inspires you. That's the beauty of the product. If you love that heavy-handed, glazed look, go yeah. ahead and put some and more you, on. You could also get yes. a, use a little towel, and you can wipe it down a little bit. If, yes. you, don't, if you put too much on, there's no mistakes, just, right? Right. If you if it, if it looks a little bit too much I, for you, just use a soft cotton Amita, cloth. And I love how it off. hits the corners and makes them look older So, oh, look at how worn. gorgeous that looks. And here you can see the contrast yeah. where it's a little bit less. Yeah, so you yeah, can do yeah. as much or as little as you like. It's very, very easy. And We're will, doing it here live. You'll learn how to use this brush too. The, using this brush is not that difficult. It's a very user-friendly brush because it has so much texture and it covers so much area and there's no angles that you have to, you just no, have to kind of. No, that round shape helps you get into right. all the angles. It's gonna help you get into all of these grooves. So that dining room that we were talking about, imagine mm -hmm. that big dark dining room and now how Look you're how going to is. host Thanksgiving or be raising your yeah. hand. I'd love to do it this year. You know, and, and what you can do, and, and here's the real uh, the killer about this and we'll show you some more before and afters. What I love is that you're not investing a whole day on a piece of furniture. You literally can do a piece in about an hour. In about an hour. And think of how did you feel about you? So you created something. You're you took something so you were going to throw away no. and you made it. And you're going to give it a new life. You yeah. can invite some of your friends over, have a paint party, mm -hmm. come over here, start with this, and then an hour later, end up with the after. And like you said, you, nobody feels good about throwing furniture away. No. You're going to feel very inspired that you've been able to reuse I, it. I love that little it. the little coffee table there on the right, the white one right there. Look at how beautiful with the little legs that things but come. I don't know what they're the called. All the details come to life. Look it's at how. Yeah. I mean, look <laughs> at how beautiful it is with the blue chair. If you've always wanted 
wanted to have that, you know, that kind of French country look. Uh, and it doesn't have to be for the whole house. You know, there are certain parts of your house where you want to keep the wood furniture in a wood tone. Right. We're not talking about it's good to blend every it. piece. Well, that's what makes it right. fresh and modern is when you have a little bit of the wood, a little bit of the painted. Right. That's why people like to use our paint, to transform a lot of that dark wood that they have and make it over. And I don't know if you saw in the before and afters, but we had a pair of lamps. Yeah. So you can paint over metal. Oh, yeah, yeah. Brass chandeliers, brass beds. Right. Old boxes. You've got planes. metal furniture over here that, you know, that you that you redid in the blue. And remember, you get enough paint to do about how many pieces? About three to four medium-sized uh, pieces of furniture. So if you see more than one color that you like, you're going to get a, a full kit of that color. This color plus yeah. you get the DVD to go along with it. You know, if you're looking for some great uh, sort of do-it-yourself projects, these are the kind I really love. Uh, you know, it's one thing to, to plant a garden because most people's gardens are gonna be gardens. But when you do something like this, when you're actually touching it with your hand, yes. it has all your personal touches. It has your story with it, it. Yeah. how you found it, where yeah. you found it, that significant moment in your life, and you get to reinvent that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna remind you, I have 780 left. Uh, this, you're only here, you, you've only been here one other time, right? Was one that other it? time. All it's right, so, and, and are you on again later on today? No, this, so this is only it. airing. All right, so if you want to grab it, it's only $99.95, but keep in mind, everything is included. You know, a lot of times you'll buy these how-to kits and they, they give you everything but the